We would like to begin by acknowledging that this land is located in the Tecumseh Tisikwetmik territory that is situated in the southern interior of British Columbia, within the unceded traditional lands of the Tisikwetmik Nation. We gather today to remember the steps Jesus took on Good Friday, the day he died for us. We will reflect and pray on Jesus' suffering and death on the cross. We will take time to ask ourselves how we are called by the way of the cross to be more Christ-like in our world today. At each station, please join us by praying and singing. The words will be on the overhead to the right of the stage. Following our closing song of reflection, teachers are asked to lead their students out quietly, beginning with kindergarten and grade one. Let us begin. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The first station, Jesus is condemned to die. Jesus is told that he will be put to death, although he has done nothing wrong. The people wanted Jesus to be punished, and even though the governor knew he was innocent, he gave in to the crowd. Pilate orders Jesus to be crucified. We've stopped with Jesus at the first station. Now let us remember and pray. How do you feel when someone says, you did it, and you know you did it? Are we ever quiet when someone else is being blamed for something they didn't do? I wonder what Jesus was thinking when they all blamed him. Dear Jesus, help us recognize your truth in our lives. May we never turn from you and your love. Help us to do what you ask of us. of any crime, but he accepted the heavy cross and carried it to show us how much he loves us. Sometimes things do not go as you want them to go, but you can't run away and take the easy way out. To really get anything out of life, you have to work at it every day. What do we do when someone gets us a job that we don't want to do? Do we have better things to do? What did Jesus do? Did he complain? Or did he carry a cross for all of us? Jesus accepted all our sins and took up the cross. Dear Jesus, help us carry our small crosses. May we not become discouraged, but remember that you are with us. Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. Jesus. He came into the world to lead us back to God, and we will finish what he set out to do. Remember the last time you received a bad mark on a test? Even though you tried very hard, you still got a poor mark. When you were disappointed, you may have thought of just giving up. Jesus didn't give up. Even though it hurts when he fell to the ground, he got up and went on. Dear Jesus, help us be like you. Help us to try again and again, even when it's not easy. Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. The fourth station, Jesus meets his mother. Jesus, carrying his cross, sees his mother. Her heart breaks with sadness that her son must suffer so. This fourth station shows Mary's great love for Jesus. 
What do we think of Mary's love for us? When is the last time you did something for your own mom? Have you ever thought of how much she has done for you? She has always been by your side when you needed her, and you have always been in her heart. Jesus didn't forget his mother, Mary. When Jesus needed her, even though her sadness was great, Mary was there. Lord Jesus, help us to be grateful for those who love us. Jesus. Have you ever tried to comfort a brother or sister 
after you both were hurt or didn't get something? Even though you may have been hurt, you tried to make your brother or sister feel better. This is what Jesus did. Even though he was hurt and sad, he had enough strength and feeling to stop and speak kindly to the women and children. Dear Jesus, help me to pay attention to the needs of others. Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. The night station, Jesus falls a third time. Jesus, tired and pain, falls yet another time. He was so tired he could not get up again. He was very embarrassed as the people laughed at him trying to get up again. No one is perfect. It is human to make mistakes, but we must learn and get up and do better from our falls. Even Jesus Christ, King of Kings, fell, but he has always got up again and went on. Dear Jesus, The tent station. Jesus is stripped of his clothing. The Roman soldiers took Jesus' clothing. They treated him without respect and tried to take away his dignity. Has a crowd of people ever made fun of you? Maybe they did not even know they were hurting you by making you feel bad in front of everybody. This is what happened to Jesus, yet he did not complain. Dear Jesus, help me not to be afraid. Jesus is crucified. Jesus is nailed to the cross and lifted up between heaven and earth. Out of love, he suffers on our behalf for our sins and our failings. Do we think we can forgive someone who hurts us? Do we pray to Jesus to help us be good to others? Dear Jesus, help us to remember your great love for us. You accepted what was to come. Be with us always. Dear Jesus, you gave up your life for us. May we live our lives for you. Help us follow your way in all places. Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. Thirteenth station, Jesus is taken down from the cross. After Jesus died, his friend Joseph took the body from the cross. 
Joseph was very sad as he wiped away the blood and cleaned the cuts of, that covered the body of Jesus. Then he prepared the body for burial. It's very kind and loving thing to care for someone else. When we care for a friend, it is easy. But what we must learn to give as much care to one who doesn't like us as we would give a friend, then we are showing our real love for them. Dear Jesus, teach us to care for everyone. station. Jesus is laid in the tomb. The body of Jesus is wrapped in a linen cloth and placed in a new tomb. A large rock is moved over the entrance to seal it. When is the last time you shared with someone? Sharing what you don't want or un sharing unwillingly is not friendly or right. But when you willingly share something dear to you, you are rewarded by having more left for yourself. Joseph shared something special with Jesus. Because he loved him so much, he gave Jesus his own tomb. Lord Jesus, help me learn how to share with other boys and girls. Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. Jesus, remember me when you come into Jesus. 